Whoa, we're all getting really dangerous now. The chase started with the driver speeding and going the wrong way. Then he hits the 110, barreling along, using the shoulder to avoid traffic. Wow, definitely looked like he, he had to have hit, maybe clipped one of those vehicles right there. The driver escapes a traffic jam and eventually gets to the port of LA, blowing past a security guard, circling and frantically driving from one spot to the next, eventually swerving around a forklift driver. The guy seems to be looking for an escape route, but can't find a way out. Somehow he makes his way to a crane above a ship and climbs all the way to the top, 17 stories or about 170 feet. A worker in the China shipping yard saw it all go down. There's stairs that go up the crane to the cab where the operator is and so this criminal was climbing up the, the stairs and then somehow the operator they got word to the operator to come back down. I kind of barricaded myself in between some chassis and some cans so that way he couldn't come and run into me. Everyone got out safely. The driver spent hours on top of the crane, flashing signs, looking nervous and agitated. The SWAT team arrived on scene. Dozens of officers suited up and climbed the crane. Is he just, he's just dangling on a, okay. After around three hours of holding off officers, the driver either jumps or falls to his death, landing on a ship below.